Welcome to the first ever episode of the Pasta Granny's Diaries. This is where I show you everything that I've come across when I'm filming grannies. And this first episode is all about making ricotta in Sicily. Like this. Mother and daughter cheesemakers Maria and Rita live deep in the Sicilian countryside near Mount Etna. And we're off to watch them make goat's milk ricotta. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. E benvenuti. Their free-range goats are special to Sicily. And every morning, Maria and Rita turn their milk into cheese and ricotta. First, Rita heats the milk with rennet to produce curds and whey. The curds form the fresh cheese. This is delicious, fresh and sprinkled with chili flakes. To make the ricotta, the women like to use the traditional method of fig sap instead of rennet. Maria scores fresh fig branches which are dunked into salted water. Meanwhile, Rita uses her experienced eye to judge when the whey is exactly the right temperature. Only then does she add the fig solution. The ricotta curds float to the top and Rita scoops them into little reed baskets to drain. Ricotta means recooked in Italian. Rita then invites us to her kitchens to show us how she cooks with it. <laughs> Maria, meanwhile, likes to spend her days with her beloved goats wandering the hillsides. Her family affectionately call her Selvatica, which means wild in Italian. Rita first makes us ravioli using the ricotta with some spinach from her garden and nutmeg. La ricotta di questa mattina. Un po' di pepe nero. Con un po' d'acqua. She makes her own bread and serves the ricotta sprinkled with wild oregano. Ricotta is also delicious roasted in a very hot oven. It's a fantastic lunch.